Welcome back to Range Anxiety TV. And today I'm gonna have to come clean with you. I did what I said I wasn't gonna do. I did a thing. You see these number plates in front of you? You don't have to know what they are, but they're for a new car that is uh, coming into the stable. And you guessed it, I buckled and bought a new Model 3 Performance because I thought if it's not that much faster than the existing car, it's my job to make it so. And already the reports are coming in. There's some firm times now. I mean, the time to beat in America with the American car, with the Panasonic pack, we've been through all of this, is 10.65 at 126 mile an hour. There's the card up there. Guy I know off uh, the Tesla Motor Club forums. Yes, it's a nerd forum. Yes, I'm a nerd. There you go, Lisa. Be happy I've finally publicly come out. Are there any times that are solid for the new car no there aren't so it's going to be my job to do it by the time you watch this i'll have had the thing in my hot sweaty hands and more than likely been to the bend and run a number just to, you know as a baseline to reel it off um i told you i kept my 400 dollar order in place i didn't cancel it and then the thing just came real real fast like all the delivery deadlines came closer and closer and closer like the expectation of when it was being delivered it was a lot sooner than i thought and so i just rolled with it i managed to sell my beautiful existing american made fremont model p uh md jr as we called it after a famous anyway more on that later but that was its name this one i'm going to call ling long because it's come from shanghai and I think it's very nice. It'll be my first China-built car ever. And here it is. It rocked up on a boat called the Leo Spirit. And someone who wants to remain anonymous <clears throat> was on the inside and was able to take pictures of it for me. The actual car checked out the actual VIN, the actual perfect thing. So it's here. I'll have sat my backside in it. By the time you hear this, we'll see this. And we will be ready to rock and roll. And you know, it's, it's, I've got plans for this. I reckon apart from that, it's just a beautiful car. And you know, why not have the new one? If you're going to do it, you might as well have the newest and the best. And yeah, it's pearl white, as you saw, which is the free color. And yeah, it's got black interior, which is the free interior. But as I've said before, I think the white shows off the lines that are roadster-esque in some ways. Look at me, I'm getting carried away. I'm excited. And yeah, it's going to be cool. So We'll probably run a tech series on it. I'll get it up on the hoist and start ripping it apart just because that's what we do around here and have a look at the new um, 4DU or 43U, whatever it is, the, the hairpin, um, as they call it, uh, rear drive unit. And we'll have a look at the comparisons with the existing and old front drive unit. So there's going to be a fair bit of tech on this thing. So stick with me. You're going to love it because we're going to tear it down and you are going to reap the benefit from it. Thanks once more for watching uh, Arrange Anxiety.